the last 10 years, we have had at least a trace of rain or snow eight of the 10 years. The only two years that were completely dry were in 2016 and in 2020. Every other year, we've had at least a trace of some sort of precip. In fact, three years, we had a trace of snow in 2014, 17, and in 2019. Now, this is at the airport. Last year, we reported a trace, but I know on the west side, it started downpouring right at the end of trick-or-treating. Now, it might be the reverse this year, whereas trick-or-treating goes along, we have a better chance of things drying out. I'll show you that in just a moment, but a pretty nice weekend first with a lot of sunshine, temps a little above average for this time of year. A few showers around again for Halloween, and then next week, I think you're gonna like this future forecast. It does include quite a warm-up. In fact, here's a sneak peek of the next four days temps will be above normal. The normal high is 56 for Saturday, Sunday and Monday and we will be in the low 60s and then on Tuesday it will be 64 degrees. Mount Clemens 43, 39 now in Pontiac, 44 at Metro and also in Seal. Let's talk about Halloween. These are the latest computer models. Download the app, the Forewarn Weather app. That is the best way for you to know exactly when that rain will hit your neighborhood and exactly what time. Uh, we're still a little far out, but at this point, it looks like we'll have some rain around during the day. You can see it's scattered, so there will be dry periods as well. Whether or not the kids can get in their parades at school, that's nah, going to be kind of questionable. And then at 8 o'clock, a lot of the rain will be south of Detroit. So it's something that we will track over the weekend for you. But just to give you a heads up, there is a chance for rain pretty much all day off and on on Halloween. 39 is the overnight low in the city of Detroit. Some fog in the suburbs, just as we had this morning. But the sunshine burns away that fog very quickly, and we reach a high of 61. Future forecast, well, once we get through Halloween with a little rain, it dries out and warms up considerably. In fact, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, temperatures well above normal with highs one week from today. Uh, close to 70 yeah. once again. We'll be at 69 degrees. Uh, we will be tracking throughout the weekend the chance of rain. I know it's just such a, a big day for kids and parades and everything outside. Uh, but yeah. at this point, just keep in mind in the back of your mind that, yes, we do have that chance for some scattered showers Sunday night and into Monday. Well, like your stats showed, we're always ready for it.